Singer, producer and guitarist Femi Leia made headlines after news of his work with Grammy Award winning Senegalese musician Yusu Ndo hit social media. The Akabo Kuna shared the news via Instagram, letting fans know something about the project, which will be featured on the Legends forthcoming album. <laughs> we are in Dakar with Femi Leia yes, doing, you know, all this stuff around my new album. Yes, yes. And all the stuff around my new album is about you. Yes, yes, it is. It's about <laughs> Africa. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, about yeah. everybody. Yeah, hey, bro. Thank, thank you very much. Thank you for the opportunity. Thank you. <laughs> Bless you, sir. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know what it is. <laughs> well, now we have Femi Lea join us via telephone to tell us more about this. Thank you for joining the show, Femi. Tell us, how did this come about? <laughs> okay, um, well, first of all, very good because uh, uh, it's, it's amazing. Even to me, I'm still. I'm still basking in the euphoria of what just happened, uh, but I I was called over to Senegal to work on the album of a particular album called The Boys. Uh, the Boys were sound to Motor Records and back in the late 80s and 90s. They are four brothers, and uh, so they are making a reunion album. So they called me up to come around and arrange their music and also produce some tracks and write. But then what I didn't know was that they already told the super about me. And uh, he was really excited to meet me and all. So I think I got the file for a song, just recorded vocals and some things, and he sent it to me over there in the studio in Dakar. And I started working on it. And uh, Yusu, of course, uh, is a top uh, government official. So he was supposed to go see the president, actually. But he said he wanted to see me first and listen to the track that I made. And he listened to the track. And he absolutely loved it. There was a song we did for Innocent. Except for the next one, forgotten. But then, and it's called Food for All, and uh, it was so amazing. We really, really loved the song. And uh, that was I have for that. You know, I, it was just an amazing experience. It was an amazing experience. He listened to my own music too, and he loved it. He was dancing, he listened to Shisha, he listened to Ayo, and he's like, wow, this is amazing for me. This is really, really amazing. You know, don't worry, uh, send me out to Nigeria. It's, it's not far. <laughs> so, yeah, it was an amazing experience. I won't lie. I really think that, yeah. Right. Can you tell us more about your work with Undo? No, it's something that has been done. I already, I already, did, I already produced two records of his forthcoming album. His album drops, well, it's exclusive. His album drops in July, you know. And uh, so I have I worked on two records. I met with his producer, also his younger brother, who listened to the tracks I did and he was blown away. So the plan right now is to I have to go back to the car and work on the other song, some of the other songs of the album so that, you know, we have to be very concrete for you. I'm really, really excited about it. He's a Grammy Award winning musician, come on. You know, this will do, come on. Have a, he's, he's a living legend, so I'm really, really excited about this project and uh, I, I just want to do what I can to make the music great. Awesome. Femi, you are a jazz artist and Yusu Ndo sound can be categorized as such. Tell us, what do you suppose Yusu was looking out for that he found in you? Well, uh, definitely it was something very African, very pan-African actually, you know, not just, um, not something that you can actually tie to a particular country in Africa, because the songs I did, they had a lot of influence from different countries, from Senegal to Nigeria to Congo to South Africa, and mixed up with a lot of all these influences to create a new sound, and it was very fresh, and also I did some other things that I'll probably wait for people to listen to, you know, on the track, but I can tell you that the sound is new, the sound is different, it's you soon do a sound, but then it's, it's, it's really, really great, it's really, really great, and, you know, when you make some kind of music, you feel like it should be your own song, but if that song is that amazing, those songs are that amazing, you know, and all that, and the message at the end, it's, it's just fantastic, so, uh, uh, when he came to the studio and listened to it, he loved it, he loved it, he was just shaking me and hugging me, and you know, I felt really, really great. Of course, we share in your excitement. You are extending your roots as well as introducing the Nigerian sound to other African artists. But did you learn anything new that would fit nicely into the soundscape here at home? Mm, <clears throat> okay. Um, I learned that one of my songs, Shisha, which is going to be my first coming single, is actually a type of music in Senegal called Mbala. I didn't know that, and I heard it in the record. So you can imagine African music is one. So uh, there are a lot of things language-wise, music-wise, percussion-wise, actually, that I learned over there. 
and their way of life and stuff that I'm going to also incorporate in my music very into the Nigerian music scene because I think it just need a better pressure, you know, it's something different in the, uh, on the airwaves and I'm, I'm definitely bringing that to the table. So, yeah. Finally, Femi, you're working towards your second album. Should fans be on the lookout for a collaboration with you soon, do, do we keep our fingers crossed? Like you said, let's keep our fingers crossed. Uh, yes, uh, definitely, you know, working with him and him loving my, my sound, uh, I'm hoping by the of God that we get to do that in my next project. I'm willing to collaborate with a couple of uh, African legends. Definitely, this is one of them. Angelique Joe, uh, a couple of other people you know, that would like to bring their sound and incorporate it into mine. So, yeah, uh, let's keep our faith stuff. We hope for the best. Yeah. All right, then, Femi, well done, and thank you for speaking with us.